the state of Oregon was getting ready to legalize. And William had this vision to make products that helped people like he was helped himself. You had two entrepreneurs that came together with an idea. It was the Wild West. It was run and gun. Things were changing on a constant basis. You're building the airplane as you're flying. We set out to start to build something. We're going to get it off the ground, start it up, and then we need somebody that's got that tenure of expertise at a sea level. Wonderful opportunity to work with folks who have been in a number of different industries and bring all of that expertise to a nascent industry and to a company that is growing very rapidly in it. The team that we have right now is the lean and mean team of soldiers who have been through a lot. They're an integral part in making this company successful. Everything at Golden Leaf has been under the radar, so we can develop effective, innovative strategies and returns to the stockholder only because we have a tremendously talented and dedicated workforce. Truly, brand is everything. So GLH is set up at this moment to deliver a sort of brand experience to the end-use consumer that no other company can really match. If you think about value that's being created, it's not being created in the plant itself, but in fact, the value of the brand, because I think this business is about attracting new users. And new users need brands for trust and integrity. One has to execute. In order to execute, you need the assets to be able to execute, especially human assets, but also the assets that Golden Leaf Holdings already has. So if you link all of those things together, knit them together, if you will, then you can achieve success. We can absolutely enhance and ignite purpose in all people's lives through cannabis. And that's, in fact, now become our mission. This isn't about getting high, it's about getting you. Now we have the ability to focus the entire organization and all of the talent here to really create a tremendous success in the marketplace. Really what it was about was the integrity of promise and purpose, which was we want to build a brand that new users could find and trust and then have the integrity of the product and the product quality so in fact it actually achieves the results they're looking for on a consistent basis. What's great is that we have a product for everyone, whether it's medical or recreational, whether it's an edible that's really low dose, to a full cannabis live resin product that the craft consumers are loving. The brand story here is to be able to welcome a new user who will be curious about the cannabis industry and will feel free to explore there as soon as legalization happens in terms of health and wellness. I went out and secret shopped all of our stores. And I was absolutely blown away by the level of talent and the experience that they all brought. And their focus really was about education on a one-on-one -on -one basis. Golden Leaf Holdings, with the dispensaries that we have and the brand positioning that we're developing, is in a unique place to be able to capitalize on that. We're really well positioned for the future. And when I say the future, I think that as cannabis becomes legalized in various jurisdictions in the United States, and as cannabis becomes legal in a number of different global jurisdictions, where you really want to be is connected to the consumer at that point in time. Still focused clearly on growing that business and creating that value, but with the disciplines necessary to make it sustainable. We have everyone's attention and that people want to make this organization a success. So now is the time to get involved.